Today, I'm gonna to show you how to count parts with your US 1011 indicator. So this scale right now is set up to a 500 pound max capacity with a 0 0.01 pound increment, which makes it a very sensitive scale. And that's why you're gonna already see that there is numbers showing up because any type of fluctuation will already add uh, value to the scale. So what we need to first do is zero out the scale and we're gonna to wanna to press and hold the hold button. Then we're gonna hit F2 and hit the print button, hit the print button again, and we wanna select number five for counting pieces and then press print. Then we'll hit the hold button once, twice, and now we're counting parts. So first what we wanna do is take a sample of what we're gonna count. So here I have these pieces and I'm going to put four of them on the scale. So in order to sample this, I wanna press and hold the total button until it says sample. Once it says sample, I'm going to hit the print key. And then from here, what I wanna do is use these numbers to enter in my sample amount. So I'll use the gross button to go to the right. And then I'll use the zero button to go up in value to select four. Then I'll hit the print key. So now the digital indicator is showing four pieces. If I wanted to see what this weighed in pounds, I'd press the whole button. And now it's gonna show me 2.86 pounds is what this weighs. So if I wanna switch it back, and then let's say I wanna add more parts to this. Here's one piece, two piece, three pieces, or I could add a whole stack like this and it will show me I have a total of 13 pieces here or 9.45 pounds. And that's how you can count parts with your US 1011 indicator. Thank you for watching.